on October 28, 2012, we know for a fact there is no place to hide. I'm a homeless veteran, and I was put out by the Veterans Administration for exposing the kind of crimes a social worker shouldn't be allowed to do, and Charmaine McPhist. Got another bit of disappointment. This place just closed, the nail salon, where I usually put my flyers right there. We had an understanding, and I did business with them. This is closed, no more. I can't understand how Ann Tenenbaum at Volunteers of America can pull this. Greg, you have no idea what you guys did and doing that to me and bringing litigation to your doorstep. Dr. Julia Golia, medical director of the Bronx VA Center. What in the hell were you thinking at? Did you think this was going to go away? Do you think trying to malign me as some kind of mental patient is going to make that go away? Do you think taking a week out of my life Locking me up and on a freaking mental ward, trying to pressure me into taking medication and psychiatric care is going to go away? It's not going away. It's not going away at all. As traumatized as it is, traumatizing as it is, to have gone through this passage, I would have never guessed. I'd bagged me. A bunch of weak-minded, bunch of imbeciles like you guys this easy. Damn, it's going to cost me a lot of pain. I will be tortured. I may not get all my benefits, but I got options. You guys can't be that stupid, that freaking dumb, that seem to think a lighter skin color trumps me. That goes for you, Greg, and Tenenbaum. That goes for you, Dwayne. That goes for you... Uh, uh, Dr. Uh, Shear, the German ki kid. I am your doctor. I didn't call you. Do I look like I have an emergency? Do I look like I have a problem? I have a role to play in a character that is orchestrating a wage slave rebellion that says either leave the United States or give me another state of reparations is what I'm doing here. You guys should have left me alone and mind your business, but you didn't want. So take a number. The storm is coming. There's nowhere to hide. That's prophetic in the litigation that's coming to the Veterans Administration and Volunteers of America. That's what I told them, because where I live on the other side of the country, it's 125, man. <laughs> 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 well, now I know. I'm going to come back. Bye-bye.